I'm trying to remember my Pokemon knowledge when it comes to Pokemon from Gen 3. I, I'm going to be honest, I am not the biggest fan of Gen 3. Um, hello? How are you doing? Hello my fellow trainers, Lee Trainer Hugo here with the next episode of the Pokemon Liquid Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke 
How are you guys doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. Um, I'm having a great day. I am here about to record the next episode of this series. If you're as hyped as I am, don't forget to smash that like button and answer the question of the day. I uh, haven't decided what the question of the day is. That will be decided later in time. I'm also going to move that just so the light's a little bit better. So, how you doing? I'm actually recording this at night. Uh, it is like breaking the fourth wall. It's 9.40 in the evening. Around 9.40 in the evening. And we are here about to take on the Violet City Gym Leader, Faulkner. Who is going to have flying types? But before we go and continue, if you skip the uh, speed up section, go back and watch it. I recommend it. But if not, if you've not seen the last episode, go watch that as well. Uh, it's a great episode. I really enjoyed episode two. I'm loving this game so far. And we are going to jump straight in with a very quick team recap. We have had one fatality. Um so far unfortunately it was willow our uh, slack off she died in the um grinding montage but let's have a quick look at our team first we have got badger the normal uh, badger the lenoon normal type holding a set one berry uh because he's got pick up for the ability so it's picking up random stuff off the ground with the attacks tackle sad attack tail whip and headbutt Next up, we have got Yin Yang, the Giraffe Rig, normal psychic type, gentle nature, early bird for the ability with the attacks Tackle, Growl, Astonish, and Confusion. Next up, we have got Mikasa, the ground type, Cubone, serious nature, lightning rod for the ability with the attacks Bone Club, Growl, Tail Whip, and Headbutt. And finally, we have got... Venus the Bell Sprout, level 15, Grass Poison type, Gentle Nature, Chlorophyll for the ability with the attacks Vine Whip, Growth, Wrap, and Sleep Powder. So, we are going to go straight into this gym. I got everyone up to level 15 in the grinding montage, just because I know this game is bloody difficult. The first couple of routes, and this place should probably have told you that, that this game was bloody difficult. But what we're going to do, we're going to keep going, and we're going to take on the gym. So, let's do that and have a very good episode today. I don't know any of the levels so far, but let's do this. Let's have a good episode today. Let's do this. Okay, so we've got Kevin. He has got a Spiro, level 13. Okay, we're a little bit overleveled for the gym. We're a little bit overleveled for the trainers in the gym, but that's fine. I'm okay with being overleveled for the trainers. Um, in fact, I'm okay with being overleveled because... <laughs> I want to win this lock, guys. I want to win this Nuzlocke. I don't want to lose. I don't want any of our Pokemon dying today. I want to have a good episode. Well, saying that, we did lose a Pokemon a minute ago. But it's fine. I don't want any Pokemon dying today. I want it to be a safe match, safe day for all these Pokemon on our team. Alan has got another Spearow, and it is level 12. Why is the second guy weaker than the first guy? I, I don't understand that. That's a little bit stupid. Badger is also a bit of a beast. Badger is like taking names. He's like kicking ass and taking names. I freaking love Badger right now. Badger's so good. But look, we're here already. We are not even five minutes into the recording and we are already at the gym leader. Oh my god, let's go. I'm Faulkner, the, Vol the po Violet City Pokemon gym leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. I want to lay off such an insult to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the majestic bird Pokemon. I don't know why I give him a New Zealand accent, but I do because I like the New Zealand accent. It's very similar to the Australian accent, but it's a little bit, you know, not. So it starts off with the level 15 pitch. Okay, we are equal levels to the gym leader. That's fine. So let's do that and okay it's good you flinched you're gonna heal okay i had a feeling you would heal i didn't get any healing items oh i made a mistake i'm gonna buy healing items and potions when we get out here to be honest i don't see badger having any trouble with this gym at all badger is putting in the finest of work in fact i'm gonna let yin yang take on the pidgeotto i think yin yang can do it yin yang is Beastly. I freaking love Giraffe Rig. Level 17 here. Okay. Use Confusion. This should do... Okay. That didn't do as much as I hoped. Okay. That didn't do as much as I was hoping it would. Um, that's fine. Keep Confusioning and see. Get a... Okay. Three Confusions. That's fine. We're taking hits. We're tanking them. And one more should finish off. 
Miss. Okay. Uh, that's bound to happen. It was bound to happen. I'm okay with the miss. We're allowed to miss. It's fine. And we did it. There we go. Right. Like six minutes into this recording, we have got our first gym badge. We've had three casualties, but we have got our first badge. Let's get some GGs up in the comments. I doubt we're going to get GGs in the comments, but we did it anyway. We bought ourselves the Zephyr badge. There we go. So, let, let's continue. So, Zephyr badge raises the power of the po attack power of Pokemon. It also enables you to use flesh inside, outside of battle, and you get TM31, which is Mud Sport. I don't know why you get Mud Shot, or Mud Slap even. It's a bit of a stupid move, but me, you get it anyway. So, let's go. Let's get out of here. Our phone's gonna go off, I reckon. Uh, okay, yep, phone went off. I know Gen 2 like the back of my hand, guys. Okay, hello, Hugo, we discovered something about the egg. The assistant the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Check it out. Okay, let's get an egg, shall we? Let's get our Pokemon egg. It's probably gonna be a Togepi. That's fine. I might not use Togepi, but it's good to have a backup mod anyway. Hopefully, it evolves into something else. Or hatches into something else, but I reckon we are gonna get a uh, Togepi from it. But yeah, there we go. We have got four Pokemon heading forward and an egg, which will hatch at some point. I don't know when. I'm gonna just check here quickly because there's normally someone you can trade with. Think of the Pokemon Bell Sprout, change with one for an Onyx. I don't want Onyx. I, as much as I like Onyx. I don't want it. I, I think Sprout is going to put in the finest of work if we can get some more type Pokemon for it. Why is it always raining in my game? My game is always rainy. Let's get some balls. Let's get some balls and some items and we will continue on our merry way. I'm also going to sell that PP Max we've got. That PP Max, I'm not going to use it. We've also got a hard stone in the grinding montage which boosts rock type moves. That could be useful if we decided to go after that, um, go get that onyx, but it's fine, I don't mind. We're gonna get ourselves some potions. I'm gonna get myself about, let's get ourselves 15 potions and get ourselves yeah, 22 Pokeballs. 22 Pokeballs, so we got about 30 Pokeballs and get one more potion for good measure because potions you can never have two little potions, especially this early on. Having potions is going to be great. Also, do you like my other hat? My other hat, it's like the... It's a, it's a, it's a Rayquaza hat. It's a Rayquaza hat. I like Rayquaza. Um, I know I like my Pikachu hat a lot. So I've got Rayquaza. I'm also wearing a Crash Bandicoot t-shirt. Because represent Crash. I don't know what that was. <laughs> but we're going to keep going. I don't know why it does that. Look, we're going to see if it does it again. Run down here. Oh, I didn't. But yeah, if you come out of an area and go back in... Uh, it spawns the berry again, and then the berry pops out of existence. Route 32. Let's talk to you, because you give me a miracle seed, if I know, if I remember correctly. Uh, souvenir from the Violet City. Yes, we get ourselves a miracle seed. We are going to give that miracle seed straight to Bellsprout, because that is going to be super useful on Bellsprout, and Bellsprout is going to be... I, I didn't mean to use. I meant to give, give that to Venus. So Venus now has... Thing. And I'm also going to move my potions to the very top because they're useful. Right, let's see if we can get a Pokemon. Our encounter for Route 32 is... Yo! Vibrava! Hell yes! It's going to take a while to evolve into a... Um... Okay, we're not going to get Vibrava. <laughs> okay, I just forfeited another encounter. That's... That's stupid. Well, it's okay. It's okay. We'll get something in the rock tunnel, but could have had my brother. So Richard has a Rattata. Our Pokemon are really strong. I might be a little bit over leveled, but it's fine. Get around female. I am going into Ying Yang. This Pokemon is designed for Ying Yang to murder because Ying Yang as we know, is a psychic type. And psychic type Pokemon kill poisons. I should know that from experience, being a poison Pokemon trainer. Poison Pokemon are my favorite. 
So I know all poison weaknesses. Level 16 on Ying Yang. Ying Yang is going to be such a good Pokemon. I really like... Uh, I really, really, really like... Um, Giraffering. Nest ball. Okay, that would have been useful. Let's run down here. What else could we have gotten this room? We could have gotten a... Okay. Okay, I'm happy that we... I wish we got the Brava. But... Yeah. Ferret. I'm, I'm glad we didn't get Ferret. Ferret lived a hit. Ferret lived a hit from a stronger move. To be honest, we've already got one of the Rattata clones with Badger, but Badger is a better Pokemon than Furry, in my opinion. I think I think it is a much better Pokemon. Uh, I also would have liked to have had um, Thingy on the team. Would have liked to have kept uh, Willow on the team, just so we could have a Vigoroth. But apparently that's not going to happen. Let's battle this guy. This Fisherman is going to have water types perfect for Venus to kill. It's going to be super useful for Venus to murder this guy, get some good experience. Well, Goldeen could be a bit of a problem, because Goldeen does no peck. I'm going to do a bit of grinding with these Pokemon, just in this section. Uh, I think Venus evolved at level 16, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, just hopefully we can get a Leaf Stone. Because if we can get a Leaf Stone, we can get a, um, we can get a Victory Bell really early on. And Victory Bell is beastly. I like Victory Bell. Um, also, I seem to just name my victory in my uh, Bellsprout line, uh, Venus. Okay, we're slower than Staryu, but we are super effective on it, so... Okay, it didn't die. I'm very surprised by that. Rapid Spin. It's not really doing much to me, actually. I'm very surprised by that. I would have thought Staryu would do a lot more damage. Okay, Venus level 16. I'm pretty sure you evolve at level 16. Might be 18, but I'm going to keep you in against this Krabby anyway. Hopefully he doesn't have guillotine. As guillotine, we are screwed. Ice cream, okay. Yo, that did a bit more damage than I was hoping. But yeah, we killed it. We killed the Krabby. The Krabby is dead. It's fine. We're good. Jackson is defeated. Are we going to have an evolution? No, we're not. Okay, it's level 18. Oh, there's an item over there. I didn't know that item was there. Okay. I did, but I completely forgot about it. Let's sneak through the grass. Hyper Potion. That's really, really, really OP this early on. Okay, what else could we have gotten? Okay. Basically, we could have got trash. <laughs> um, I would have rather had the Bravo. That's, that's a level 12. That would have been pretty good to have. That would be basically usable right now. Uh, Mikasa is the weakest Pokemon on our team, so Mikasa needs to get some battles. This trainer is in our way, so let's fight her. Let's fight this last, kick up butt, and we should be fine. I think I think we're going to be fine. Apom. Okay. Apom can hit hard. Um, I have noticed in other games, Apom is a rather strong man. But our Cubone is stronger, it seems. We're doing more damage to it. So a headbutt, scratch, headbutt, and defeated. Okay, there we go. Because that was not as difficult as I thought it was going to be. I thought that fight was going to be horrendous. Apoms terrify me. Okay. Would you like to try a stage and use this slope tail? Only one million. Sure, I don't want it. Scram. Okay, fine. Screw you. Screw you, you ugly fat man. Great ball. Nice. Okay, we got another Pokeball. That's good. And we're going to heal. We're going to heal up. Here. And we can also get ourselves a fishing rod. Uh, I'm not going to fish in the Union Cave. But I can go back to Violet City and... Get, uh, do I want to? I'm, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Because it's going to be an old rod and... I might not have... I don't know if I've randomised the water. If I've not randomised the water... Okay, match revive. That's pointless. If I've not randomised the water by accident, then we're going to get a Magikarp. And I don't want a Magikarp. Even though Gyarados is a pretty clean Pokemon. I like Gyarados. It's a really strong, powerful Pokemon. Just, it's not the best Pokemon to have. It's 
especially having a magic up which can't do anything. It's basically like having uh, a Cubone at like level two. Like it's like Cubone under level nine. It's sort of like very difficult to use. Whereas Cubone, Cubone after level nine is a powerhouse. Just can't hit flying types until you've got you know headbutt, which you learn at level thirteen, I think. Level thirteen or fourteen. I learned headbutt. I'm not entirely sure. I think it's 13 uh, that I learned headbutt, but let's defeat this Pidgey. I'm also quite pleased with myself. But I have not used speed up this episode. I have not used speed up in this episode. Yet. I used it in speed up to make the speed up, the grinding montage go a little bit faster for me. But I have not used speed up in actual gameplay today, which I am very happy about. I am more than happy to not use it. Okay, we have defeated the Pidgey. We are going to get our randomized Union Cave encounter. Far-fetched. Okay. Let's kill this. We're going to get our Union Cave encounter. Hopefully, it won't be anything ridiculous. Okay, Far-fetched is confused. Hit yourself. Hit itself. Good. We have got a very good team when it comes to not being hit by anything. Hell yeah! We're doing really good, guys! James is defeated. Birdkeeper James is defeated. Let's go in here and heal again. That max revive I am selling as soon as we get to Azalea Town. There's no point in me going back up there. And I just knocked my microphone. <laughs> I've, put, I've moved the microphone a little bit. It's a little bit closer to me. Before it was over here in the corner. Now it's like right here. Oh, it's slightly off screen, but you guys can sort of see it. But meh, let's go. Hey! Hey Zane! It's you again! I'm heading to his alien town to take out the gym leader. I have already thrashed Violet City's gym leader. See you at the gym for a quick battle. Just to show you how strong I've become. I'll see you later, Hugo. Prepare yourself. I like the fact that we got a couple of new gym, like new rivals in this game. Okay, Union Cave. Let's see. What do we have here in Union Cave? Our Union Cave encounter is Snow Run. Okay, that's different. I'm okay with a Snow Run. So I am not going to risk attacking this thing. I am just going to throw a Great Ball at it and hope we catch it. I think we can catch it in a Great Ball. Snow Run, you're going to join the team. You are our weakest Pokemon if you do join. And we did. We have called ourselves a Snow Runt. Okay. You're not going to be able to turn into anything other than a Glalie. But that's fine. Snow Runt. It is said that, our home, uh, it's said that a home visited by Snow Runt will prosper. It can withstand cold of minus 50 degrees or 150 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. So I am going to nickname you. I'm going to nickname you. What am I going to nickname you? I want to nickname you Sherpa. I don't know why. Sher... Sherpa. Sherpa. I think that's a good name for it. We've got Sherpa the Snow Run. So, we have technically got a full team of six, but eh, it's not really a full team of six. So we've got Sherpa. Ice type, gentle nature, inner focus, can't flinch. That's good. That's really good. Okay, it does have a lower defense though. Powdered Snow, Double Team, and Leer. Okay, I am going to do a bit of switch training with you. Just so you can get up in the levels. What else could we have got in here? Could have got a Tangela. Okay. I'm actually going to let Sherpa fight this Tangela. Because Tangela is... We are super effective against it. Because it is a grass type. And grass are weak to ice. I've never used a snow run. I have never used one before. I think it looks really cool. It's one of those Pokemon I just think looks cool. And I like Glalie. I like how Glalie looks. But I have never really used one in a game before. So, yeah. I think having Sherpa is going to be very good. Hopefully, it doesn't die to this Tangela. Okay, this Tangela is getting on my nerves. But we are super effective against it. So we should kill it in this one hit. This hit should kill it. It should kill, and it did. There we go, Sherpa. 
Sherpa could actually be very useful against the... I'm trying to think. Would it be useful against the gym? I don't think it is. I don't think it's useful against bug types. Which is a little bit bad. Let's give Sherpa a potion. Sherpa is probably going to be safer to, um, you know, switch train. Um, I know ice types can be quite strong offensively, but especially against certain types, but I am not going to risk it. I don't want to risk the biscuit. So we have got Onyx, level 16 Onyx versus Sherpa. Sherpa is not fighting this thing. <laughs> Uh, we're going to send in Venus. Venus should be fine against this thing. Fine. Okay. Okay, fine doesn't really do much. So let's do a fine whip. Do a fine whip. We are, you record weak to us. So, look at that. Look at that. We're going to kill this thing. We, we got this Onyx killed. This Onyx is out of here. Absolutely out of here, Onyx. Get your butt out of here. There we go. So, Onyx has been defeated. Sherpa is level 10. Look, bite. Oh my god, you're even more versatile. Damn. Okay. Snow Run is very versatile. I did not know this. So let's... I want to battle all the trainers in here to get Sherpa a higher level. I think Sherpa needs to join the team. Well, Sherpa is joining the team. He's on the team. But Sherpa needs to be made a bit stronger. Okay, Geodude. Um, I'm actually going to quickly have a look. And just see what ice types are weak to. <laughs> Because I am very newbie when it comes to ice types. So ice type Pokemon. Super effective. It's ground, grass, flying, and dragon. Weak to fighting, fire, rock, and steel. Okay. Now I know. Uh, knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe! I'm not sorry. <laughs> I am very hyper. I have started work again. Um, for those of you who don't know, I am an English teacher at a uh, Chinese school, um, hence why I live in China. I am an English teacher, we have just started the new term, and I'm having a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying it. Um, again, I've only been at work for about three or three days, as of this episode being recorded. Um, as of the, f like, this episode as well is being recorded before the first episode of the series has actually come out for you guys. So, by the time this comes out, I would have been at work for about a week, and I have had I'm having a great time. So, yeah, I am loving teaching. I absolutely love it. I love this job. Um, but doing Pokemon content and making videos for you guys is what, also what I love doing. I love making content for you guys because I just love entertaining and I always have done. And I just think this channel, this channel has been one of the best things that's happened to me in recent years. Uh, this and the Twitch channel and everything. They've both been the two best things that happened to me um, since making content. Um, I could say my old YouTube channel as well, but that channel, a lot of stuff has been a bit weird with. So we got a great ball. Um, and by weird with, I just mean sort of iffy with some things. Pizza. That would have been that would have been quite tight. But I'm happy. I'm happy with Sherpa. I am really happy with Sherpa. So um, I am gonna run. I'm not gonna fight this thing. Uh, I'm also going to see what Badger has. Let's take Asper Berry. You're just picking up berries. I know pickup is useful. I think it's more useful the more you level up, the higher it gets. So what are you going to have? You're a fire breather, if I remember correctly. You are a fire breather. Okay. I am using basically my knowledge of the last game. Yo, coughing! I'm using my knowledge of Gen 2 to my advantage here. Um... But, yeah, I, I don't know everything. Uh, so, some of it is a little bit hazy. And I am just assuming things are the same. I'm assuming things are different as well. Um, there's going to be a lot of different stuff, I know. A lot of differences to this series that um, I'm not going to know. Because I know this is a fan-made game. And fan-made games often throw curveballs at me. So, Slowpoke. Okay, sure, get in there. And we're gonna. 
And then we could send, we could probably send in, um, you're level 18, so yeah, I don't need to send something in. Uh, I'm gonna send in Venus. I'm gonna give Venus a go. Let's send Venus in. Sherpa is gonna catch up eventually. I made a bad choice. I was hoping you would Well, there goes my I don't want any Pokemon dying this episode. Okay, Venus, I apologize for that. That's that's bad. Okay, Sherpa. Let's do fight with faster than it. Did nothing. Okay. Okay. Um Badger getting there. Badger. Okay. I'm not. I'm upset that we lost. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Okay, it didn't do as much damage as I thought it would. I'm sad we've lost. Dingy. I'm sad we've lost Venus. Again. We can never keep. We, we can never keep Bell Sprouts. Bell Sprouts and Weaker Bells are just doomed with us. Chef is level 11. But. I'm not, I'm not upset about it. Um, there's no reason to be upset about it. Let's go put him in the box. Uh, actually, no, I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to keep going forward, get to Azalea Town. Kingler. Okay, that would have been pretty clean, actually. Problem is now we don't really have anything to deal with water types. Water types are a bit of a problem. But at the same time, only one of our Pokemon is actually weak to it. Okay, run. There we go. Okay, Sherpa is a little bit on the slow side, but it's fine. It is fine. We will be absolutely fine. Steal it! Ooh. That would have been very clean getting Sherpa the heck out of there. Are you serious? Are you serious? We could have got a Jirachi in here. Game. Why? Why? What else could we have got in here? There's got to be some, like, crazy mums in here. What else could we have got? Pinsa we know about. We know about Pinsa. We've seen Pinsa already. <laughs> oh, we could have got Jirachi, guys. That would have been so cool to have. I'm gonna go up here, cause, or down here, because there's gonna be items that we need, probably. Or oh, items just to collect, because I think there's gonna be stuff we wanna collect. Okay, you have a level 18 Slowpoke. Again, okay. Um, Ying Yang? Yeah, Ying Yang, because you've got a ghost type. You've got Astonish, and it will be super effective. And it's just going to use, try and use Confusion on you. You can use Astonish. Super effective. Doesn't do a horrendous amount of damage. But it could potentially make the guy flinch. So just keep using Astonish. And hopefully we'll beat it. Hopefully this thing will go down. There we go. Okay. I... What? It wasn't even in the red. What the hell? So I'm speeding up the spike. This fight is slow. That was a very slow battle. Because it's a slow poke. And slow pokes are tanky. They are very tanky. So, probably a good idea that we did that. Let's go down here. Get this item. Swift. Okay. TM39. Swift. That's awesome. There's another item I know. I'm just using my knowledge of it. Yo! It's Ying Yang's brother! Yo, let's kill it. Let's kill it with Sherpa. I think Sher Sherpa's gonna two hit this. There we go, Sherpa! Hell yeah, you are a beast. You're not a beast yet, but you will be eventually. I think it's level 30 you evolve. I am pretty sure. I'm trying to remember my Pokemon knowledge when it comes to Pokemon from Gen 3. I, I'm gonna be honest, I am not the biggest fan of Gen 3. Um. Hello? How are you doing? I'm just gonna go. Okay. 
Okay. Me cancel. You can kill this thing. It'd be some good. It's gonna be some good experience, and we got lightning rods, so it's not actually. This Reiku's gonna. We can grind on Reikus! No one has ever said that sentence. We can grind on Reikus, guys! No one has ever said that sentence. It gives you like 300 experience, that's good. We got missing... <laughs> And it killed Sherpa. Screw you. Why the hell is there a Starly in this game? And why is it missing now? And why did it kill Sherpa? I'm a little bit annoyed by that. Let's kill Sherpa. Why? I'm just running. I'm glad that was not my encounter. Sherpa didn't even make it out of here. What the hell? Slugma, okay. Mikasa, kill it, please. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed that we lost Sherpa. We literally just got the bloody thing! It's fine. It's fine. I loved you while we still had while we had you, Sherpa. Just as long as none of my other mums die. Route 33. We can catch something here. Can you give me anything? Can you give me spitted. Okay. Let's catch something. What can we get? My catch for Route 33 is... Yo! Yes! I freaking love Lantern, guys. I love this Pokemon. I freaking love it. Come to me! Come to me, Chin Chow. You are a cute little anglerfish. Ah, oh, yeah, there we go. We got Chin Chow. In the dark ocean, on the dark ocean floor. It only means of communication is in its constantly flashing lights. We have gone anglerfish. And I am going to name you the best name ever. I am gonna name you. How do you spell Zeus? Is it Z E U S? Zeus. Yeah, Zeus. I'm gonna name you Zeus. You have been transported to death, but I'll get you out in a minute. So let's talk to you. This kid won't let me get anyone go to his alien town until he found his poker doll back. Okay. Thank you for the repel. I left it in here in cave. I can't find it anywhere. Can you let me miss you? I want you want it back. Okay, let's go and get this kid's poke ball, poke Pokemon back. Yo, we could have got a swallow. That would have been pretty tight. I haven't actually looked at uh, Chinchow. I haven't looked at our Chinchow, guys. Should probably do that. Oh no, we can't because the. Never mind. I thought we could look at it. Why is there a ball over there? We can go behind the cave? Oh, there'll be another exit. There might be another exit. Okay. So I'm going to go in. I have a feeling I might know where it is. It might be the down bit. Because there's no way it's going to be in the up bit. So, and there was an area that looked a, bit, a little bit suspicious that didn't have an item in it. And I know for a fact it normally does in Gen 3. I'm pretty sure it normally has one in Gen 2. Is it? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so that just pops in whenever there's a thing. We found the lost item. 
put in our key items pocket and let's get out of here and go and give this to that little boy who looks very much like a girl but is fine okay clefable by the way i've just thrown this out there i know we haven't found one yet and we've never found one in a series but if we find a shiny pokemon shiny claws is activated we will attempt to catch the shiny because like and it will count as an encounter because shiny pokemon are super super useful and super good to have i know that, that well let's say they're super useful they're not really useful they're just sort of there <laughs> they're just uh, they count as another encounter let's give the boy his doll thanks for finding that doll for that kid i won't be able to go to the gym otherwise see you later hugo okay zane see you later welcome to azalea town so what I'm going to do, I am going to put our dead mons in the PC. I'm really annoyed about Sherpa. I'm going to let you guys... Oh, I'm not going to let you guys decide because it sort of defeats the purpose. Sherpa died. But a part of me wants to bring Sherpa back because Sherpa did die to a missing knife. So, yeah. Let's get Zeus out of the box. Put Zeus in the party. I'm going to let you guys decide uh, should Chirpa rejoin us because it died to a missing no or should it stay dead I'm going to let you guys decide that um, before this or when this episode comes out so means I'm not recording for a week but <laughs> I'm going to let you guys decide because I think you guys should be able to decide that for me so we've got Zeus. Zeus is level 6. Water Electric type. Quiet. Luminate. Oh god, that's bad. That's a bad ability. Oh well, you have Bubble, Thunder Wave, and Super Sonic. Okay, you don't really have anything amazing move-wise, but uh, it's fine. It's fine. Should I see? I'm actually going to try Headbutt in a Tree again, see if we get an encounter here in Azalea Town, because I would love to have another encounter. I doubt we will end up getting an encounter, but we've got headbutt of all trees, so let's headbutt a tree. Let's see if we get anything. Do we get anything? I doubt we're gonna get anything from these trees. We got something! Okay, Azalea Town encounter. It is Apom! Okay! I'm okay, okay! I wasn't expecting an actual encounter from one of these trees. Okay! I am okay with an APOM. Hell yeah. Um, it's not a different type of ball that works especially weak. Well, I'm um, a weak type of um, The problem is, I don't know how to fight this thing. Because we are all, well, let's go to Badger. Let's go to Badger and let Badger headbutt it. Well, not headbutt it, just tackle it. I want to catch this Apom. Let's end the video with an Apom. I'd be happy with that. Speed up. Okay, that's fine. Let's catch an Apom. End the video with the Apom encounter. We have got a randomized Pokemon here in Azalea Town. Which does lead me to believe that we could, okay, probably get something in Violet City as well. That would be pretty useful to get. Okay. I might do that. I might go back to... You know what? I know I asked you the question about Sherpa. Oh, the Sherpa question. But if we can get a Pokemon here, I'm going to try and get one in Violet City as well. Um, I'm going to have Ultra on this thing. Uh, I'm going to swap into Mikasa because Mikasa can tank more hits. Mikasa has more defense. But we got this encounter, so I'm I'm pretty I'm okay with not having Sherpa. Sherpa did die after all in a battle, so Sherpa is considered dead indefinitely. Um, I have got 25 points. I've got 26 points. We should be able to catch this thing. Come on, one, two. Come on, get in the ball. I'm 
speeding up because I want to catch this thing. Come on! I gotta heal. I've got to heal. There we go. We got Apom. Apom has been added to the party. That is good. Okay, Apom. It lives atop trees, leaps from branch to branch. Okay. I am going to name you. You are a boy. I am going to name you. I'm going to name you after my brother. I'm going to name you after my brother. I think I did this in the very first series as well. I am naming you. Level after my brother, level 13. Who has recently, as of this video going out, he has started at university. So, congratulations to him and my other brother, Sketchit Plus. They've both started university. Um, they are my real brothers, by the way. <laughs> I'm not just saying they're my brothers because they're my friends. No, they are my actual blood relatives. And they've both gone to university. And we've got level the Apom, who is level 11. And he is a normal type, docile nature. Pick up for the another Pokemon pick up. That's really useful. Okay, scratch. Tail Whip and Sand Attack. Okay. So, I am going to end this video right here. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to slap a like on it. And also, subscribe and answer the question of the day. If, oh, subscribe if you're new. Ask the question of the day if you're not new. Because that would be amazing if you could. Um, and I will see you in the next video of Pokemon, Pokemon Liquid Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke. So, ladies and gentlemen, I will be heading back to uh, Violet City to get some, to get a tree encounter because why not? And uh, yeah, I am here in Azalea Town, and we're going to end the video. So, thank you very much, guys, and I will see you all next time. <laughs>